and now the ship forecast, issued by the Met Office on behalf of the Maritime and Coast Guard Agency at 0015. The area forecast for the next 24 hours. Viking, north at zero. Westerly, 4 5, occasionally 6 at first, backing southerly, 5 to 7 later. Showers, rain later. Good, occasionally moderate later. I get some early age I was drawing a lot. Just always enjoyed sitting in front of the TV as a kid drawing cartoons. There was a kid that used to pay me to do his art homework at school. I guess that's when I first thought I might be able to make some money out of it. I don't really do it to, to make money out of it. It takes the joy out of it, but I've got to make money. <laughs> work out whether I wanted to do illustration or fine art. So I ended up doing the illustration route and then got into graphic design after I left university. Just taught myself typography and I did an MA in illustration and developed my graphic style more. And then I got a job in publishing as soon as I finished my MA moved to France and got into snowboard magazines and then on to skateboarding magazines which I was really into. It lasted for 16 years. As things were dissolving with factory media, people that I work with being made redundant, I just decided to move back to Brighton where my daughter lived. And uh, I shared with someone for a while. You know, I just hated compromising my space. I was a bit pissed off one day and I went down to the marina and I just thought, fuck it, I'm gonna live on a boat and start sailing and perhaps just travel the world <laughs> doing my work. So I started learning, you know, all sorts of things like diesel engine mechanics and navigation and how the sea moves and everything, you know, how the wind's created and all this stuff I'd never thought about. Then I started doing these nautical inspired collages just from being quite immersed in that sailing culture. Just find all the navigation aspect quite fascinating. So. And for years I've wanted to get into oil painting. And I've always had this idea of doing typographic paintings, but I just didn't have a, a beginning for it really. Someone introduced me to um, a Leonard Cohen song, and it just really inspired me to put some of the words down as abstract shapes on a canvas. It was kind of the, the catalyst. I just really enjoyed looking at serif fonts. You know, they're quite gracious shapes. You know, they're quite beautiful things. Spent hours repainting them and trying to get the colors right. Just, you know, struggling artist stuff, which I quite enjoyed. Masochistic sort of painting. <laughs> I guess with the work I'm doing now, I don't know what I'm doing. I just feels right or wrong at the time. If it feels right, I stick it down. And if I'm not sure about it, I don't stick it down. I don't know, it's not a conscious decision. 